it's uh, Wednesday morning, I think, pretty sure. Kind of lost track. We've been doing this since Monday. But I've noticed that every morning since Monday morning, we have a little less ambition to get up, to come up here. Robert's still in bed. Um, I didn't want to come up here. I didn't want to come up here to this place. I just didn't. I think the seven ideas was, or seven ideas, Jesus, seven days was a bad idea. This will be basically, what's well, Wednesday, technically it's three days. We did investigate a little bit on Sunday, so four days, four nights of investigating is just way too much saturation. I feel a little angry. I feel kind of the feelings I used to feel at the stagecoach in. Um, I'm not, uh, how do I say it, um, self-analyzing myself, you know, checking my pulse or anything, but I have this just tension around me all the time. A little bit of anger, like pinned up rage. The only reason I'm up here right now is I'm offloading all the video from last night onto my PC, which is right here. You can see, pick it up, see the tip of it there. And I'm just trying to get all that video. But uh, I'm, I'm, I'm seriously considering on calling it done. Um, maybe not tonight. Uh, we might not investigate Thursday night. It all depends on how I feel. I've been down this road before. I can, I know, I, I can kind of say that I know the science. And it's, it's not good. I, I, I recognize a lot of what I went through from the stagecoach. This is not going to be a, a habitable place until it gets thoroughly blessed or exercised. One of the two. Laugh as you may. I don't care. As I say, you decide. I've decided. And that's just me. That there is something here. It, it's not aggressive in the manner that it like it. it bites, scratches, and punches in your face and all this kind of stuff. It's not that. It's, it's kind of an oppression. There's traffic outside. It's mid-morning. I'm shooting this off of my phone. Um, I mean, like I said, I'm, I'm collecting last night's information. Robert doesn't even know I'm doing this, so... Whether this even ends up in the documentary, I don't know. I'm, I'm actually a little bit embarrassed sitting here talking about backing out. But that's called wisdom, I think. I think that's called wisdom. I know, I do know enough. I've always said to people, you know, anymore, I don't know enough to say I know enough. Well, I do know enough when it's time to back off or back out. Last night, I was extremely forceful in some of the stuff that I said. And I, I had a terrible night's sleep. I slept, but I felt angry even in my sleep. That makes sense. I, I don't know if it does or not. Maybe some of you will understand that. Some of you may not. But again, I, 
I am not comfortable with staying here another night and doing more investigations. I'm going to have to do it at least one more time, but I think I'm going to just dial it way back as far as aggression to try to get activity. The activity's here. It's here. It's like it's it's hanging on me like a wet dog. So, I don't know. It's one of these places where, you know, doing this for as long as I did at, at, at the Stagecoach Inn and recognizing that weird energy, devices don't have to go off for me to know that there's something going on here. No, I'm not sensitive. I am not as sensitive. I am an experienced investigator who has been down this road before. And I have submerged myself in this investigation as I did the Stagecoach Inn. And it very much mirrors each other in, the, in their presentation. Is this house haunted? It is. It is very haunted. This will cause a lot of darkness. There is darkness. That's, that's the best way. It will cause darkness. It is darkness. And I think that's why there was so much death here. Strange, bizarre death. I do think it has to do with some of the... Without outwardly saying their name, it wouldn't be proper. I'm just going to call it uh, organizations that were attached to this location for many years over and over and over again I do think it has something to do with that I do think it has something to do with Robbie who was here all this darkness so anyway I'm, I'm just gonna see what tonight brings and uh, we might just be spending Thursday night just sleeping and uh, getting ready for Friday, which is a little show that we come down here to do um, as well. So I'll leave it at that. And it sounds almost redundant, but... Uh, because I think you know what I'm going to say, but you decide.